Hey there, I'm Angelo and in this video let me show you a super easy way of removing a background from an image using Adobe Express. This is a great web-based tool for designers and non-designers alike to simply remove a background from an image in just a few clicks. I'll also show you how to place the same image in a social media layout using Adobe InDesign. So let's jump right into this tutorial and start creating. Once you've launched Adobe Express in your web browser, go ahead and create a new project. Let's click this plus icon and then choose Remove Background. Next, drag and drop the image that you want to remove the background from and you can see Adobe Express will detect the subject in the image and remove the background. Once the background has been removed, go ahead and click Download. Great, the image has been downloaded and the background's been removed. I can go to InDesign now and add it to a project. I'm in InDesign now and you can see on my screen I have an Instagram post for a fictional learning platform called Skillset. I want to add that image that we just removed the background from in Adobe Express. So first things first, I'm going to grab the rectangle frame tool and I've set up some guides here and I'm just going to draw out a rectangle where I'm going to add that image. But before I do, I'm going to go to my swatches panel and click on this light pink color that I have here. Now I want to round off the corners at the top of this shape. So I'm going to click on this yellow box here, click to edit corners. And here's a little tip. If I want to edit just one of the corners, hold your shift key down, click the top one, top right, and bring it all the way to the center. And do the same for the left. Just hold your shift key and bring it to the center. I'm going to send this shape backward and to do that hold your command key that's control on windows and use your left square bracket to send it backward. I also want to add an inner shadow effect to this so I'm going to go to my effects drop down here and choose inner shadow. And you can see with my preview on I just want to change the angle of that to minus 110. And I'm going to change the opacity to about 30% and click OK. Now here comes the fun part. I'm going to drag and drop the image inside of that shape. Once it's in the shape, right click, go to fitting, and then fill frame proportionally. Click the content grabber, use your option command, that's control and alt on windows, and greater than to increase the size. Click the content grabber and position it the way you want. Once you're satisfied with the position, right click and copy. Click on the pasteboard, then go to edit and paste in place. And lastly, use this frame to crop out everything aside from the subject's head. That's a super simple way of removing a background using Adobe Express and placing it in a social media layout in InDesign. Want to learn more about InDesign? Check out this playlist right up here. Until next time, take care and keep creating.